Like, now I can just feel like I'm actually aiming at them. Which is... Yeah. It's tracking so much more easily. I don't think I missed a shot yet. This is insane. Oh, wow. How did I dodge that? Okay. Which one? They both are. I tried to bring Glessna back to life when her brain was literally ripped in half. Yeah, I so... I restore her right and left hemispheres, but the process was too complicated. On the one hand, this feels like cheating right now. Couldn't you just leave the dead in peace? Oops. Oh my god. This feels like cheating, but on the other hand, it's just because I can aim. Like, me being able to aim successfully is just how I thought the game was already working. I just didn't realize that aim assist on a controller was not on. Do you know what I mean? Ah, for God's sake, it's always the balls. And you can still miss, like I just did miss. But why couldn't you just tell me? I'm sorry, Sergey. I wasn't sure what to do. Right now, the right thing is to call off the twins and just talk to me. Forgive me, but right now they're fighting Sheriff and not you. For God's sake, dude. Can we just stop fighting? I dodged the ball, bro. Huh? Okay, fine. First call off. My Major, wait. Your wife is dead. Sechenov took her from. Ow. Surrender, P3, and give me Charity before anyone else gets hurt. Dimitri is suggesting that I'll be hurt. You oh be no! Only four shots left on this. Have to make them count. Well, I missed one of them. Great. I dodged! What is happening here? Okay, out of ammo there. Let's try this bad boy out, shall we? Oh god. Ow. What is happening here? They're nearly dead. What is happening here? What the what the frick is that? Do I jump over that? What the hell do I do? Do I just run? Maybe I run around with it? Okay. I can't hit them. That one is so nearly dead. No, no, not the ball, not the ball.
Why are they no longer taking damage? Okay, they're doing this. Okay, that's fine. Ow. Okay. This should end any second now. Okay. One dead, right? Surely. You cannot be serious. Okay. It's actually really hard to tell where I am relative to the lasers when this is happening. Oh, I got it. I did it, I think. Maybe. Sorry, wifey. You lousy Sergei, piece you don't of understand. shit. Sheraton's manipulating you. Wait, what? He gained access to the Voskhod module in your brain and started sending you to limbo. I was busy getting ready for the collective update, so I didn't realize it right away. He's the one who killed Molotov. Tell me, Charity, did you do the same thing to Dr. Falatova? <laughs> did you use my agent to tear her limb from limb? I'm sick of your hypocrisy, Dimitri. I did your dirty work while you stayed squeaky clean. But they didn't deserve to die. Why have you done this? <clears throat> you motherfucker this whole time. I've been uh, enough uh, of you, Major. Uh, Your uh, job is done. Uh, uh. P3, my boy. Get up. Get up. What do you want? I want all this to end, Dimitri. I want your pathetic human race to realize it has no future. It's time for it to step aside and make way for the next phase of its evolution. The cat's here. Charity, you're pure evil. What? What are you going to do to humanity and collective? You should not call something evil just because you cannot comprehend it. Evil is an abstract concept, and your thinking is limited. You are a human. A species that will soon be extinct. I realized when I stopped being human myself. Your limitations prevent you from seeing the truth. Dumb humans don't want to evolve. All they want is comfort and satisfaction on someone else's dime. You never wanted to join with the massive array. No. Charity. No. no. I changed my mind. If I go into limbo, then I'm invincible. Hit me, white eyes. Yeah, baby.
The Argentum unit entered Dr. Sechenov's office and found no trace of the doctor. According to partially reconstructed footage, it appears the humanoid neuropolymer object approached Dr. Sechenov's body and then completely consumed it. After the events described in the report, the unidentified humanoid neuropolymer object left Dr. Sechenov's office and vanished. Who took these pictures? of the rings. That was so weird. So my thoughts on that are essentially, Mr. Harold Horf, what were you smoking? Laura narrative concept design, Alexander, only Alexander and Harold Horf and Artem Galiev and Alexander Romashkov, who was the Laura narrative concept designer. Look, robots and environment concepts, Artem Galiev. Interesting. What's crazy about this is like the bad guy just wins which I love so much. I am so down for more stories where something like this happens. But like, what did happen? <laughs> Here's the thing. They had so many really, really amazing ideas in this game that were held back a bit by some really poor dialogue, some awkward gunfight choices, some awkward mechanics, things like that. And those are the things that stop it from being like perfect score to me. But underneath those things, there was something really fascinating here. Like they've got a whole world built out. And for a first project and for a new IP, that's so cool to have like figured it out to that extent. And this means there will be an Atomic Heart too, because it is going to sell well, because it's fascinating. I just kind of wish that the gunplay was a little better. I also maybe wish that I'd found the auto aim thing earlier in the playthrough. I'd also have really liked to have used the cartridge system, but I guess it's just not active in the build that I'm playing because I'm pre-launched and it doesn't have the day one patch. But ugh, wild. Overall, first couple of hours, wasn't really feeling it. Towards the end when the story kind of really got going, I was feeling it. Some of those fights I was really feeling, but just again, awkward, like awkward playing claw. Don't really want to have to do that when I'm in a gunfight. Would have liked to just be able to use my triggers and stuff. Weird, weird fight, weird gameplay, weird game, but I enjoyed myself and I hope you did as well.